What's up guys, today I'm going to show you how to set up MLA format in Microsoft Word. So we're going to begin by uh, making sure you have Times New Roman size 12 and um, you're going to start out by typing. Well actually first you want to go to the spacing here, select it 2.0 and then remove spacing after paragraph. This gets rid of the extra space that you don't need. Now, first you're going to type your name, and I'm doing this with one hand, so. Then enter once. Um, then you're going to put your teacher's name, or professor, or whatever. whatever. Um, then below that, you're going to put the class. And then you are going to put the date, which should be in the format day, day, month, year. That's the format you need to put the date in. Then um, you go down one more, go to center, and then this will be the title of the essay. And then what I like to do is go down one more, back to the left, then indent, and write start. That's where I start writing. Um, now, to get the works cited page, you would go to the insert, then page break, then go back here to center, works, cited, and now the works cited page will always be at the end, no matter how much you type here, like whatever you type. Let's say you get to the second page of text, it will move the works cited page to the bottom again. Um, so let's get rid of that, and there we go. Now you'll also want for the MLA format to um, have a header with your last name and then the page number. So you do this by going to insert page number, top of page, then just plain number one, and then you're going to highlight it, move it to the right, and then in front of it you're going to put a space, you can use the arrow key, and then put your last name, so like whatever, last name and then exit that, you'll see that it's your last name 1, then on the works added page, last name 2, and it will automatically do the page numbers for you. And that is how you set up MLA format in Microsoft Word.